is mostly a 25 hour race. Hi, I'm George Crump, lead analyst with Storage Switzerland. Thank you for joining us today. As you'll notice, the studio is a little different today. Uh, we decided to try to merge the lab into the uh, into the studio to kind of show you a little bit behind the scenes what we're doing at Storage Switzerland. As most of you know, I am a, uh, a Macintosh guy, and so wherever possible, uh, although we have plenty of Windows servers in the lab, uh, I like to use uh, a Mac. And so, but one of the challenges has been performance. Uh, the certainly the internal hard drives, as you can see right here, uh, don't perform real well. And externally, we've had some issues as well. Now, the ironic thing is the, all the new modern Macs have a great uh, port in Thunderbolt, but getting to that performance has been a challenge. Uh, this has recently been uh, solved in a big way for us by uh, Otherworld's uh, computing uh, Helios product that allows us to uh, use a PCIe uh, SSD or PCI, any PCIe card, as long as it's uh, certified, uh, with the Thunderbolt port. So let me open that up for you real quick. Here's the unit on the outside. It requires obviously power and things like that. But if I open this up, you can see right here, I've got a PCIe expansion uh, chassis or board slot right there that I can put a PCIe card in. And that is going to give us a very good performance. So to get started, uh, let's try uh, using the, the product with uh, OWC's uh, uh, Mercury Excelsior uh, product. This is just the 128 gig product. We wanted to make sure that uh, you know it would work and, and all that kind of good stuff. So we got it all from one vendor to start with. So I'll go ahead and install that. That's uh, pretty straightforward. Just plug the card uh, into the slot like that, and then we're ready to go. I'm gonna obviously normally you would cover it up, but I'm gonna leave it off for now since we're gonna be doing a lot of videos. And then on the back of the unit, you can see right here that we've got a Thunderbolt expansion um, ports, two of them, so we could daisy chain if we want to. And then, of course, here's the, the power. So the, the unit does require external power, uh, but the, uh, what's nice is if you've turned your Mac off, uh, the unit shuts down. There is a little bit of fan noise. Uh, if you're in a very quiet office, you might notice it. Uh, I, I doubt seriously that the uh, microphones here are picking it up. Uh, but really, that's about it. You're, at that point, you're ready to go, and you can um, uh, use the unit as if it were a uh, internally attached uh, PCIe SSD. And as you can see right now, I've got this is just the internal hard drive uh, getting you know. 70 megabits a second on writes and about 67 megabits a second on reads. Uh, that that test will that result will stay about the same. Uh, right now I'm only doing uh, a one gig stress. On even if I do a bigger file, we'll see a little bit of a, a pickup, but not much. And there's the read performance. So let's switch that over. As you can see here, we've the Excelsior has uh, come up. We of course got some data on it and things like that. But let's go ahead and just uh, do our test to it. We select the Excelsior, and now do our speed test. And so you can see a significant gain in performance, up to 240. Uh, megabits a second, uh, and then read performance is fantastic. And, and this will go up just a little bit. Uh, so write performance is pretty good. Read performance is off the charts, literally. Um, so very, very impressive uh, performance delta. So uh, the other thing that's really nice about this particular card is we can boot from it. Uh, so uh, let's go ahead and show that real quick. So we've got the, we'll stop our test right here. And we're going to do this in real time uh, because I want, to, I want you to see just how quickly uh, the boot process is uh, as a result of this. So what I'm going to do very quickly here is set my uh, preferences to boot, boot off of the Excelsior so I don't have to uh, do anything at uh, startup. So I'll go ahead and hit restart now. Okay. 
Okay, now we've restarted. You'll hear the chime in a second. There was the chime. And there we are, we're booted. The other big thing on uh, any Mac of mine anyways is I've got 1,800 programs that have to load. So that's the other big thing is to watch how quickly the, the system actually comes ready. And so that quickly, now I'm ready to go. That's a big difference from booting off of the hard drive. So I would say uh, all in all a great test of the uh, uh, the OWC product, uh, the, the SSD is, is good, uh, to, but to be honest with you, we have seen better, but it's also very cost effective. Uh, what I'm going to do in our next video, we'll do a um, test of a different product and show you how that works in this unit. But for now, uh, you know, the uh, OWC unit, the PCIe expansion has been a, a big gain for our lab. This is George Crump, lead analyst with Storage Switzerland. Thank you for tuning in.